to Luis TV. This is gonna be the last wrench test I'm gonna do. I've done city wrench both in winter and summer just to see what the difference is. Mostly what the wrench loss is on the bike. And now I'm gonna do the interstate wrench test. I've already done one in the winter. It was about 36 degrees when I did it. It's in the mid 70s right now. So we should be able to get a pretty good comparison between winter riding and summer riding on the interstate. I got 45.6 miles on the interstate in the winter and during the city test the bike was able to give me about 18 percent more range between winter and the summer so i'm guessing that my range will also improve about 18 percent on the interstate so that should put me around 53 or so miles the manufacturer estimates 40 miles on the interstate so the bike overperformed in the winter i'm expecting it to overperform ever so slightly in the summertime so let's see what this thing does battery the mileage is 46.1 not even close to Albuquerque I got a half of a mile extra not what I was expecting at all dude I was expecting you to help me load the rims <laughs> I'm sorry Jerry Coco the CEO of Coco Racing has picked me up on the interstate and the result it's better than the manufacturer estimates the manufacturer says that the highway range is 40 miles for this bike I got 46 one so it overperformed by 6.1 miles in the winter I got 45.6 I didn't realize the drop-off in range from winter to summer in the interstate would be so small so that's good in conclusion the bike performs over the estimate of the manufacturer and the wrench loss between winter and summer is half a mile on the interstate again if there is any real noticeable drop-off in the winter it's probably at temperatures that are so low you wouldn't want to be riding in those temperatures anyways so enjoy the bike the range is six miles more than the manufacturer estimates way to go zero